Leisure by William Henry Davis, 1871 to 1940. What is this life if full of care? We have no time to stand and stare. No time to stand beneath the boughs and stare as long as sheep or cows. No time to see when woods we pass, Where squirrels hide their nuts in grass. No time to see in broad daylight Streams full of stars like skies at night. No time to turn at beauty's glance And watch her feet how they can dance. No time to wait till her mouth can Enrich that smile her eyes began. A poor life this, if full of care, We have no time to stand and stare. OK, so William Henry Davis, he's a Welsh poet. Um, he, let's see, uh, he came from Wales, um, and I think his father died when he was something like three years old, and I think he was looked after by his grandmother, um, and he came from a poor family, I think he, his first, uh, he was apprenticed to become a, a picture frame maker, but he didn't like this. Um, and he, various times he went to the United States and lived as a tramp, lived on the road, um, doing, uh, enjoying his life, yeah, effectively living. Um, there's one sad story that um, when he heard that there was gold in the Klondike, he set off to make his fortune in Canada. And while jumping on a freight train, um, he lost his footing and he lost one of his feet. It was crushed under the wheels and he wore uh, a peg leg after that. OK, so, yeah, what's this poem about? This poem is saying stop and smell the flowers. Yeah, if your life is always full of worrying about what you're going to do, worrying uh, about how to make more money, worrying about what's going to happen next, this isn't living. To be alive, you need to stop and look at the beauty of life, the beauty of nature, to think about things. Yeah, I think they say that 99.9% .9 of the things that we worry about never actually happen. So that's clearly um, suggesting that we shouldn't worry. And he's saying, OK, if life is, is just something where you've got to obey society to do the right thing and you don't actually talk take the time to smell the coffee, to stand and look at things, to think, to see beauty. No time to stand beneath the boughs, beneath the branches of trees, and stare as long as sheep or cows. So if you see a sheep or a cow, very often they sit there and they just look and they don't move. Yeah, and uh, if you take the time to do that, then you start thinking and your brain goes round and round and that's very good. No time to see when woods we pass where squirrels hide their nuts in grass. Yeah, so you can't see the wood for the trees. Um, yeah, when, when, when you go past the woods, actually look at them, see the beauty, go into them, enjoy them. Yeah, find the squirrels that are hiding their nuts in the grass. Find the different things, but take time to look at things, not just rush by. Yeah, it's, it, this is perhaps one of the things that I find frustrating in cities. In cities, everybody walks so fast, and that's because everybody's in a rush. I've got to do this. Take it easy. Take your time to do things. Take the time to enjoy something. No time to see in broad daylight streams full of stars like skies at night. Yeah, so stop and look at the streams, look at look at the, the water running, look into the water, see the beauty inside the stream, see that it's full of stars and incredible things. 
yeah it's like the sky at night look up at the stars and wonder about them and see the beauty enjoy the beauty of life because this is what living really is no time to turn at beauty's glance and watch her feet how they can dance so here he's per personifying beauty yeah when something beautiful looks at you well it could be a beautiful woman yeah maybe watching a beautiful woman dance that's a beautiful thing to do that's living or but when something beautiful comes into your life or comes past you whenever you see something beautiful stop and look at it and think about it and enjoy it just enjoy the beauty enjoy the dance of nature what watch how um be how beautiful things are and enjoy them no time to wait till her mouth can enrich that smile her eyes began so again no time no time he repeats this yeah and this is the problem with modern life i've got to do this i'm late i'm late i'm late yeah um i'm late for a very important date i'm late no there are things that are more important than the requirements of our society the requirements of life yeah so um wait until the mouth of beauty yeah uh makes even better the smile that her eyes began so beauty's glance beauty looks at you yeah so imagine it, this is like a metaphor of of um beauty a beautiful woman looking at you yeah and wait stop let her talk to you talk to her enjoy it yeah so um uh don't just rush past when you see something beautiful but enjoy it enjoy all of it don't just look at it and go but look at it get deep into it put your soul into it and enjoy it a poor life this if full of care we have no time to stand and stir so life is 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 going to be very poor if the only thing you're worried about is the day-to-day -day things of life you need to have take the time to stop and look at things and that's the idea of this stand and stare s s sounds quite good as well okay so enough if you enjoyed the video give it a rating subscribe to my channel and i'll see you soon Bye for now. Leisure by William Henry Davis.